Well, you want to talk about a guy who has taken the sport by storm. Enter Zabit Magomed Sharipov. I don't think we have enough buttons on the controller to do everything this guy does in the cage. No, you can't even button match some of the okay. techniques that Zabit has in his arsenal. But the problem with preparing for Zabit is that you can't prepare for Zabit because there is no pattern. There is no rhyme or reason to what he's doing. Just look to the modified knee bar right. to get against Brandon Davis to finish that fight to some of the other fantastic performances he has. It's almost like you're staring down the barrel of a tested algebra 10, which doesn't even exist when you're trying to prepare for that beat. have come out to see this man throw hands here tonight. You can argue he has some of the best boxing in this division. But fighters are a sensitive lot. It's like every time we put over his hands, he feels like we're saying out of the other side of our mouth that he's not well-rounded. That's not the case. No, we're not calling him limited at all. We're not saying this guy can't do everything. But what pops off the page is his hands, his hand speed, his power in his hands, his ability to set up his hands through his face and his movements. He can do so many good things in the boxing realm that you're locked in on that thing. But make no mistake about it. This guy is very well-rounded, but ultimately, it will be his boxing yeah. that will allow for him to be successful. And defensively, certainly he's not going to be confused with Pernell Whitaker, but he moves his head very well, manages distance exceedingly well. Sweet view. And stylistically, oh, sweet view. Sweet view is an all-time And now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. All right, now for the particulars, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Zombie Magomed Sharipov! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, the Korean Superboy, Do Ho Choi! One of the best in the business, Herb right. Dean, is our referee tonight. Right. Our right, round one underway. This man is all the rage. The Korean Superboy, Duho Choi. Very difficult challenge for the opponent here tonight. This is an outstanding first round fighter. Outstanding fighter overall. But the fight time of the UFC, not a lot, because more often than not, he gets the opponent out of there in round one. Early round action here. Captain Hook lands on the kickboxer. Beautifully timed and placed there. And a strong way to start on the feet. Kickboxers love the high guard. The way to fight the high guard is to throw things around the side. That hook is a very good shot that can land against a guy with that tight high guard. Wide right, side control now, DC. You know he's in his element on the ground. A lot of tricks up his sleeve. A lot of tricks. Beautiful transition. He's having his way with him here. Magomed Sharipov is back to the side control now. Continuing to stay busy here on the ground. We'll see what he does here. He postures up and lands to the head. Man, another one lands. He's trying to pound his opponent's head through the canvas. Look at him, he's setting up a choke now. Look at that, he's setting it up. Oh, he's in trouble here, DC. He's got the triangle. Oh, the pressure going down on his opponent. Oh, that's got to be it. Oh, somehow, some way, he got out. These guys are back and forth, but the submission defense wins this transition. I give one, I take one. Know what you're gonna 
get out of Zabit Mago Med Sharif. Oh, roundhouse kick. Takedown defense holds up. Under three minutes to go in round one. Nice jab. Good straight hand there by the Korean Superboy. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Nice punch there by Mago Med Sharif. Beautiful timing on display there. Nice takedown land. Looks like he's trying for a submission now. That guillotine is very tight. All right, so now going to position over submission as he bails on the sub. Oh, that's how you do it. Postures up and lands to the head. Another ground and pound strike lands. Making all these shots count. All right, he's hanging out inside the closed guard of his opponent here, DC. You gotta be careful. Mago Metsharupa is in half guard now. Oh, when you get in a bad spot on the ground and you want to reverse it, that's what you need to do. Master class in changing position, unreal to see. 90 seconds now to go in the round. Can't take many of those, you better check. Start kicking, kicking the body, kicking the head. He's just got to start kicking. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. So beat Mago Mencharupa going for the takedown, but unable to land. Choi's cut above the eye, and that blood figures to start to trickle down to compromise his vision here moving forward. Straight right hand now, just misses. So 42 total strikes and counting have landed for Zabit Magomed Sharipov. Choi is able to switch his stance here to see how the defense responds. Posturing up now. And now the damage is about to start. Oh, he's got his back. 15 seconds. He's in the mount. Great defense by the defensive fighter. Oh, that horn sounds oh. means we have reached the end of round one. Heading back to the corner now. Choi's got a cut to deal with above the eye, or perhaps better put, the cut man has got to deal with it. We'll see if he can stop the bleeding. All right, we got a few clips for you, DC, of all the damage doled out in that round and his eye continuing to be the main target. I mean, it's getting hammered. He is getting hit in that spot over and over again. And because of that, his opponent has gained in confidence and he is very limited in what he can do in his approach because safety has to be first now. Ready. Ready. Go. All right, round two. Nice straight right, Lance. Here he has landed several in this round, and if you are a counter-striking stylist, you can do worse than watching this guy compete. Beautiful job defensively. Head great timing on that double leg. Ooh, heel hook attempt now, and it looks locked in. Oh, that looks wicked tight. Going very hard to try to finish this fight by heel hook. He has got to secure the leg and keep the hips past the knee. Will suffocating work from the top here by the Korean Super Bowl. Gotta be careful here. Kick the ball here. 
All right, side control now. Magomed Sharipov is right back to the full mount. Can't get it. Good awareness by the defensive fighter. Nice positional control here. Choi's in half court. Oh, beautiful transition right into side control. And busy as he looks to improve position here. Magomed Sharipov's back in side control here. All right, so now we start to see some redness underneath the elbow. You gotta think he's gonna continue to attack the body with all of his strikes. Well, his opponent has not done anything to deter him. He should keep doing this, keep going to the well until his opponent finds an answer because right now, he seems lost to it. Ooh, right into side control, DC. This is where you wanna be now because you get to make your opponent decide. They try to turn back into you, you can attack guillotine, if they turn away to try to get to your knees, you throw, and now he's a tip to choke. Oh, he's got it locked in. He's got that arm triangle deep. Oh, he's getting submitted. You gotta be kidding me, he's out. Man, that is loud. Another strike lands for the kickboxer. He really found that flow state pretty early in this fight, and he hasn't looked back. He found it really early. And when this guy gets into his groove, he is hell on wheels. And right now he is showing why he is such a high-level, high-regarded kickboxer. He is outclassing this guy. Lands with the ground and pound. These ground strikes really started to add up. There's another one. All right, we'll see if he can apply pressure inside his opponent's guard here, DC. Choi's back in half guard. Looks like the cut man to my right is starting to get anxious with all the high volume of strikes being landed. Look at him attacking that guillotine. Oh, nice guillotine there. Oh, he's out. Nice shots landing from the top position. Well, defense doesn't always win championships in MMA, but how about the submission defense tonight thwarting one attempt after the next? Yeah, and the fact that he's just constantly under attack tells you he was very prepared for the type of fighter that he was in front of. He knew there would be some submissions coming his way. He was ready to defend them, and he has done that beautifully. Mago Metsuripov going to work here for the guard and doing a pretty good job, I might add. Well, you see all the grappling repetitions here. Just beautiful movement, seamless transitions on the ground. Over and over, these guys are doing things that you see in every jiu-jitsu gym around the country. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Oh, brilliant execution to land the roundhouse. 10 seconds to go in the round. Yet another huge kick lands. Two rounds in the books. All right, now we take a look back at some of the action in that previous round, DC. A lot to like on both sides, really. I mean, both were intent on going forward. And what happens when nobody wants to take a step back? They meet in the middle. That's exactly what they did, and they both found success over the course of that round. You ready to fight? You ready? Third yeah. round underway. Place with that lead hook by Mago Medsharikov. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Seems to have timed that counter pretty well. And now some separation. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. 
Nice leg kick. Just misses with the right. Takedown defense holds up. Short uppercut in the clinch by Chor. Nice loop and punch. The fighter blocks a punch. Don't wait, you hit him first. Throwing that jab now again. The fighter evades. Ooh, big shot lands. Take it for a ride. Nice double leg. Nice finish. Lands a strike now from the bottom. Nice work there by Choi. Postures up and delivers a massive ground and pound punch to the head. There it is. Now you run him up. Mago Mesharipov's going for a choke. Oh, look out, folks. That is tight. It looks like he's getting going. He's up. What submission defense on this play? And he's back up. Well, he has really started to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. So we have crossed the midpoint in this one. Counters with the straight leg. Oh, he lands that too. He's got a good leg kick. There it is. Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. Oh, what a punch. Nice leg kick. Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked. The hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything coming. Throwing that jab, no good. Oh, nice jab there by Chor. And he continues to work the body here. Oh, another bruising shot right to the body. I wouldn't think you want to take too many more of those. No, John, you got to you got to defend. You got to address a tactic that has worked this many times this early in a fight. You cannot allow it to continue to build because once that momentum gets going, you will have no way of stopping. And I don't have a lot of muscle over there, so I don't <laughs> think I could take too many of these if I was a fighter. Well, you need that body like mine if you want to get hit down there. You can't be you can't be too skinny. All right, so look at that. A cut has been opened around that eye area. He's taking shots over and over again to that area, and now he's dealing with a cut. Nice body shot. Well, he continues to stay busy, and he continues to land with volume punches here. I mean, volume, but he's not wasting anything. He's so accurate out there. Nice spinning attack there, and able to land to the body. Stuffs the takedown. No problem. Oh, and he continues to pour it on. We mentioned earlier the aggression with his striking. Got to be careful to not gas out here, but at least you have to admire the approach. Nice block. Punch went nowhere. Oh, how good is that jab by Choi? Champ, look at that redness underneath his elbow. A lot of those strikes to the body starting to pile up. Getting beat up and being smart enough to not be dead hurting the entire time. I like this. I like this approach. All right, again, he shoots for a takedown here and unable to get it. So the takedown defense reigns supreme yet again. The takedown defense is holding up, Johnny. He's doing a great job of keeping his feet going backwards, sprawling, dropping his hips, and anticipating the shots coming. Very well done. Well, what a round it was, especially from a striking standpoint. DC, take us through. High-level striking. I mean, this is what people come through the doors to see. Two men stand on a quarter, chest to chest, forehead to forehead, and let it all fly. I'm surprised nobody went out, but it does excite me for the next round. You ready to fight? 
Ready. Good. We have arrived at the fourth round fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. All right, next round is underway, and both fighters still look pretty fresh to me, DC. Maybe, maybe they're doing your sprint workouts during training camp or something. I mean, these guys are known for working very, very hard. Both of them make cardio a very key factor in their preparation for showing on both sides of the octagon. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Oh, he gets tagged there. Nice combination. Superman punch lands. Well, you know this is the hurt business, and both guys are compromised at this stage of the fight. Yeah, both guys are compromised. Both guys have been beat up. Both guys have done a great job of landing, recognizing what they wanted to get done, and it's showing. This is a very evenly matched fight. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hit the skate. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Oh, man, he's getting deep. You gotta be kidding me. How did he get out? He just stayed calm. He was able to withstand the fire, and now he finds himself out and safe. Back to the feet now. Beautiful high kick. Overhand is good. He's throwing bombs. Every time they come into contact, he is throwing bombs. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Beautiful strike there as he continues to attack that cut. Cut man's gonna have some work to do if we get to the stool between rounds. But that's why we got the best in the business. We got the best cut men in the business, and they are going to need him right now because this cut is getting worse, and it's only gonna continue to get worse because he has got a killer in front of him. Oh, he's setting up an arm bar now. What a tight arm bar. He might get a finish here. Done. He loves to fight on. All right, working on the ground here. His opponent's feet on the hips. Lands with the ground and pound here. And another one. Another strike from the top. Lands for him. So beat Mongo next Shurikov. Ground and pound from half guard now. Let's see if he can do some damage. Great submission defense. Under two minutes now to go in the round. Nice transition. Beautiful ground strikes landing. Oh, nice job to split his guard and get the ground strike home again. Oh, huge pop from the crowd as the fighters get back up to their feet. I mean, you have beautiful timing and placement to land the flying knee. Collar tie here in the clinch. There's that body shot. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Got to be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. Look at the good action that comes from just throwing that kick. Push kick there to the body. Oh, nice. Well, you can sense the corner frustration. He has not had any answer for these body shots, and now you see the visible damage. Well, his coaches are wondering, where's the defenses? We worked on this. We knew this would be an attack that they would come with. Why are you not doing what we've trained? He's got to change something, man. He's got to tuck that elbow. He's got to roll and turn. He cannot continue to take these body shots. Look at him yank the head and land that beautiful punch from the clinch. Oh, nice jab by Mago Med Sharipa. Choi's all sorts of bruised up on his body. That is going to hurt something fierce tomorrow. Final seconds. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. Horn sounds for the end of round 
fool. All right, so the round is over, and you see the cut man not wasting any time as the fighter makes his way back to the stool. The cut man will try to shut that cut on the bridge of his nose and prevent it from becoming a factor here moving forward. All right, well, I'm no doctor. I'm not going to diagnose a broken nose, but a huge cut on the bridge, and his opponent continues to attack it. Continues to attack it as he should. He did the damage. He was the one that landed the shot that opened up that cut. Now he's got to make his opponent pay for it. He was a bit lax in the defense, and now he's got that massive cut on the bridge of his nose. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. Fifth and final round, fourth cut. Joy gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. Wow, huge head kick. Magomed Sharipov's attempt there is blocked by the opponent. starting to open up wider now, and he continues to target that area wisely. Well, when you saw it right away, it wasn't that bad, but as he continues to target it, you can start to see it opening up. Look for him to continue to go down that route to try to get this victory. Nice job paying attention on the defensive side. Oh, beautifully placed with the left hook counter. Nice head kick. Nice combination on the feet, and now works it to a takedown. Mago met Sharipov's in half guard. Pretty good work with the strike there from bottom position. A lot of top pressure being applied here. Mago met Sharipov's right back to the full mount here. Posture's up now. That's a vicious head strike. How'd he take it? Oh, good movement to avoid that strike from the top. Certainly a strong front runner for fight of the night as we go down to the wire here between these two combatants. They're both so skilled. They're both so prepared. We knew right away this is going to be a very evenly matched competition. Going for an arm bar now. Oh, he's got the arm bar deep. Also, how about that position over submission as he bails on the side? I think that's a great job. You've got to make sure you don't end up in a worse position because you're trying to score a submission. All right, he's got the full mount now. Is this one of the most dominant positions in MMA? Is that fair to say? It's a very dominant position. It's one of the most ideal positions you can get to, especially if you are fighting someone that doesn't truly understand that they're not in as much danger as they are. All right, so he's got the body locked down here, DC, or so it appears. This is not a guy you want anywhere near your back. Mago Sharipov's in half court. Oh, he's got the ground and pound going now. Oh, we'll see if he postures up and can get some of his ground strikes going here. Another ground and pound strike gets home. Mago Sharipov's back in half court. Wow, so somehow, some way in this final round, back to the feet. It's like he's playing the lottery, John. He got to his feet now, does his numbers hit. He has got to hit every button to try to get a finish. Choi's taking aim at that cut right now, DC, and you got to admire the fighter IQ, right? Might as well keep landing strikes on a target that you have damaged repeatedly throughout the fight. Big double leg level change. I'll go next in half guard now. Seconds to go in the fight. Oh, that's got to be discouraging as he gets right back up again. If you're going to go out, go out on your shield. If you're going out, go out on your shield. Don't just walk backwards. Go forward. Make him fight you. Circling to his right. Now some separation from his clutch position. Oh, God, I'm flush with the head kick there, DC. Beautiful setup to get his leg up there quickly before his opponent can react. All right, so the swelling becoming a real factor right now. Did they inject something into his face, or is he just swollen from the strikes? <laughs> swollen from the strikes, man. Guy taking a couple shots. You never know which one is going to start to make you get damaged. 
Something good landed, and now you see the smoke start. Ago met Sharif Pobbs trying for a submission here. Oh, I don't know. That heel hook looks tight. Oh, really going hard now to try to finish this fight by heel hook. Oh, it's a fight here. Let's see who's going to get it. Oh, a lot of danger now. It looked like we might get a win by submission instead. Right back to his feet. Go Med Sharipov getting work to the body here on the ground. It was the elbow there. He didn't think that would be the strike coming, and he paid for it. Big ground and pound. Oh, what a finish to this one as we go the full 25 minutes. Stand and cheer, ladies and gentlemen. Well, don't leave it in the judges' hands. A little bit easier said than done. Competitive, close fight. You got to lean either way. I mean, it is horrible when you walk back to the center of the octagon not knowing exactly who won the fight. I thought he won a lot of the striking exchanges, but it wasn't very clear. So it'll be interesting to see who gets the decision. We'll see how the judges saw it. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. For the winner by split decision, the Korean Super Boy, Du Ho Choi. So the Korean Super Boy, Du Ho Choi, with another highlight for the reel tonight. That reel's getting pretty crowded. Crazy to think this guy is just getting started. Maybe a few years removed from his fighting prime. We'll see just how far he can take it, but tonight, undeniably, a huge step in the right direction for a guy who could